the Crown of Ireland Act of 1542, 16th century Ireland, a land rich in history and strife. People from various walks of life go about their daily activities, but there is an undercurrent of tension and unease. In the early 16th century, Ireland was a land divided. The English crown held authority over a portion of the island, while Gaelic lords and chieftains ruled the rest. The reign of King Henry VIII marked a pivotal point in Ireland's history. Seeking to assert greater control, the English crown devised a plan to bring the entire island under its rule. Enter the Crown of Ireland Act of 1542, a significant piece of legislation aimed at achieving the English crown's goal. The Act sought to establish the English Crown's authority throughout Ireland, endowing it with the title King of Ireland and dissolving the independent Gaelic lordships. The Irish chieftains and representatives, aware of the impending change, reluctantly agree to the terms of the Act. Some express reservations, while others see an opportunity for collaboration and compromise. The Crown of Ireland Act brought significant changes to the island. English common law, administration, and governance were to replace traditional Gaelic systems. In Ireland, some are sceptical of the Act's promises, while others hope for a brighter future. Dublin Castle became the seat of English authority, its governors tasked with implementing the changes envisioned by the Act. While the Crown of Ireland Act aimed to unify the island, it also led to increased tensions and conflicts. The English presence bred resentment and resistance among the Irish population. In the wake of the Crown of Ireland Act, the Gaelic lords and chieftains who had lost their autonomy began organising rebellions against the English rule. They sought to protect their cultural identity and preserve their traditional ways of life. The Act not only sowed the seeds of resistance but also intensified the divide between the English settlers and the indigenous Irish population. The Crown of Ireland Act exacerbated the social, cultural, and religious divisions that existed between the English and the Irish, further deepening the chasm between the two groups. Despite the hardships and struggles, the Irish people's spirit remained unbroken. Their resistance and determination kept alive the flame of independence. The Crown of Ireland Act of 1542 forever altered the course of Irish history marking a pivotal moment in the English colonisation of the island and the subsequent struggles for Irish independence.